If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. In this lesson, we will examine using the client credit card account to track and pay all client costs, if allowable, within your state. Remember that if you do use a client credit card to never mix charges between the client and the firm's credit cards. Before you begin, you should review all of the lessons within Chapter 21 regarding entering and paying credit card bills. You can enter charges using the items you created just as you would when creating bills for payment from the client trust account. You simply enter these charges into the Enter Credit Card Charges window by selecting Banking, Enter Credit Card Charges from the menu bar. Then select the Client Trust Credit Card Account from the Credit Card drop-down at the top of the window. Be sure to use the Items tab to enter the line items that represent the services and expenses you pay from the Client Trust account. Just as when creating bills, be sure to mark each line item as not billable when entering the charges. When you have finished, click the Save and Close button to save the charges. When the credit card bill arrives, you can then reconcile the client credit card account with the bill received. After a successful reconciliation, you can select to enter a bill for the charges, and be sure to select the correct Client Trust AP account from the AP account drop-down at the top of the bill. Then select the Credit Card Account from the Expenses tab at the bottom of the bill. You can then click the Save and Close button to save and close the bill. You can then pay the bill that was received by using the Pay Bills window to pay the bill entered against the Client Trust AP account with funds from the Client Trust checking as usual. Remember to click the subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www.teachucomp.com.